why do narcissists hoover you back? And they walked away and they maybe even moved on and they did all the things to make it appear very obvious that you're not important in their life, right? And they didn't want you. And then all of a sudden they're trying to suck you back in and they won't stop coming at you with more and more interactions and more and more just trying to pull you back into engaging in any kind of conversation with them. So what are they doing? So a narcissist may have moved on and be with new supply and then they're contacting you. Okay, so there's one kind of Hoover where they will keep contacting you as if they want you on the side or as if they want you back or as if they don't really like this new person, but they they really just want you. And what they're doing is they're using you for a certain kind of supply that they get from you. They're using you for the things that they love about being with you. And at the same time, they're using that other person for the same thing, like what they like about that person or what they need from that person. They're getting different supply from different people. They don't like letting go of the attention and the supply and all of the focus that you're giving them. It gives them total control to know that they have you on the hook. It gives them the feeling of power and the feeling of control to know that you are spending your time worrying about contacting them, worrying about being with them again, wishing you could have more of them, wishing that you could talk to them or fighting with them, trying to get them to leave you alone, pushing them away. They get supply from that as well. When you're being hoovered back in, it starts to create a supply and demand cycle okay so every time you're being hoovered back in every time you're being pulled back into engaging with them your brain goes right back into the trauma bonded state into the loops of being responsible for them trying to fix things with them trying to walk on eggshells so that that you're providing a situation that can possibly succeed with them all of those things that are not a healthy life for you but are focused on the narcissist, it creates that cycle, which gives the narcissist 100% of the power in the situation. It puts them in charge of your well-being. We have to remember they miss your supply. They don't miss you. They miss your supply. They miss the attention. They miss the focus. They miss you chasing them. They miss you being upset about them. They miss you worrying about them. They miss Everything that you give to them is what they're missing. They're not looking at you as an individual because they don't love that way. They love based on what it gets them, right? They don't love based on who the person is they're connecting with and they don't even really connect. So that's, you're, you're basically, you're entering into it, hoping for something better. And in fact, when you, when you respond to a Hoover by going back or by re-engaging with them, you end up with something worse and it's usually pretty quick.